Good afternoon, guys. I think I'm maybe going off camera there. Sorry. I'm currently live and I thought I would jump on and show you guys the random stuff I bought while we were in Amsterdam. I've got a few really random bits. Not as many mm, naughty, cheeky bits as I'd have hoped. But I know every time I show them on here, Facebook don't like it. They tell me to get lost. So I thought I'd be a good, good girl. I tried. Anyway. How is everybody this afternoon? It is currently 20 to 4 in the afternoon. It has been a long day today. Very long. I think we're still feeling the hit of exhaustion from walking miles. I actually said to Cole when we were in Amsterdam, it was like our holiday in America. Not the way it is, but see when you go to America on a holiday, it's not a relaxing holiday as such. You walk miles and Amsterdam was the same. We wanted to see as much as we possibly could staying there the two nights. So we walked and walked. We found as much as we possibly could. But I'm going to let you see some of the stuff I bought while in Amsterdam. So I'll start off something really cute. Seen these in a shop window and I thought I've got them. They're really cute for Hudson. So I got them these little Adidas trainers. Thought they were super cute and his feet are constantly growing. And he's got huge feet, really big feet, but I'm very lucky because I've got two of my friends with little boys the same age and they've got teensy teensy feet. So they get all of Hudson's shoes because he's grown like a mushroom. He's a big boy. Oh, I got this in Primark. Primark. A little shower caddy. Thought Gianna would like that. She loves stuff like that. Thought it was cute though. Keeps it all off the floor. Or Hudson likes to get all the shampoos and stuff and pour them all out. Would you go back, Lynn? I would absolutely love to go back to Amsterdam. I would definitely say do three nights if you're going because there was so much. Like, I really, really enjoyed it though. We had the best laugh in Milan. We had so much fun there, but I would definitely say Amsterdam was more to our taste of just being nosy. I, I just love people watching. I love people watching. So we've done a lot of that. So I got some sweeties for the kids. Did you, oh my God, wait till you see these. You ready? Are you ready for these? I am praying Hudson will let me put them on them. Look at them little cow they're like we slipper clogs how amazing is that are they not just the cutest what were they 16.50 that's some expensive slippers did you visit Anne Frank's house we didn't we were running out of time so quickly and honestly, at times we went back to the hotel just to sit down for half hour because our legs and feet were on fire. Look at them! Little Holland cows! Are they not just the cutest bee slippers ever? I thought they were so cute. I was very close to getting Gianna and Kai some, but I didn't want to ruin their street cred, right? I think I'm prudish, but still intrigued. Do you know what, Donna? You'd be very shocked. I think it's one of them places you you don't have to go and do like the red light, stuff like that. But you definitely can if you want. And for me, I just like being nosy. I just love looking at other pe people's lives, if you know what I mean. Like just people watching and it's such a different life to here in Scotland like 
walking down the street and seeing different things, even hearing different conversations and stuff, and you're like, geez, that would never happen in Scotland. Or I don't want to see it anyway. <laughs> Some more sweeties for Gian and Kai. All the American style sweeties. But yeah, I didn't actually get that much because all the naughty stuff I'm not allowed to show. I got these, so a few years ago, I've seen when we were in Lanzarote, there was a shop we found called Bershka, and it was absolutely amazing. I loved it. Gianna loved it too, and she got these trousers, and she fell in love with them and was desperate for another pair. Lo and behold, they had Bershka in Amsterdam. They do have a website. This is not an ad. They do have a website, which I did get a couple of the trousers on, but it's definitely not as good as inside their shop. So I got G them. Right, these. Hair curler set. I got these to try. I think I'm going to try pop them in my hair tonight and see what they look like in the morning. I'm not sure how good I'll be at it, but I thought I would give them a bash. I found them in Primark. Was it expensive? I personally found it very expensive. Like alcohol, pretty much most, I thought was pretty expensive. But I, th I don't know if that makes a difference as well. I'm sure prices will be higher in the city centre as well because their rents, everything like that, is going to be much higher. So it shows in their prices of everything. But yeah, there was one pub we went into and we got two drinks, a shot each, and it was 50 pounds, well, 50 euros. Like it was, I found it pretty expensive. Right, and the last, oh, these are the cutest. I got this for Gianna, because I thought it was super cute. Little bear. I love Amsterdam. There's Bershka in Manchester. Behave. Really? No way. I went to Belgium with a school back in the day with history. I loved it. Hi to Amanda King's little boy. We have been to Florida. So both times, we've been twice or three times? Twice. Uh, we've been to America, we've been to Florida. First time we've done Universal, second time we've done Disney. And that little magnet! I just thought it was super cute because there's the clogs everywhere. And at first I didn't actually realise there's tulips everywhere, like beautiful tulips, like everywhere you go and then when we were in the Ripley's believe it or not it actually said that back in the day years and years ago in Amsterdam they used to actually use tulips for money so tulips was your cash essentially so people would trade tulips for their items instead of money how crazy is that? Because me and Cole were like, what's with all the tulips? They're everywhere. Tulips and clogs. <laughs> well, I'm not sure if they are called clogs, are they? I used to have a... I'm sure there's Bershka in Liverpool too. You're blowing my mind. Well, I absolutely loved it. I got these jeans in Bershka when we were in Amsterdam. Got the wee buckles, the big baggy going for the skater girl. So yeah, we had an amazing time and some different little bits and bobs. So I like to keep my magnet. Sit on there actually. City centre is very expensive because of all the tourists. Great place, but expensive. Absolutely. That's what we found. It was absolutely amazing. I would go back in a heartbeat. There's not many places, if I'm honest, that I would be like excited to go back but I would definitely be excited to go back there there's so many different things to do 
oh my god bikes are everywhere you even if you're not on a bike you could probably my hair is just falling out everywhere hudson has been ragdolling it all day and i've done it a million times and i've gave up um yeah you could probably get away with walking up the street wearing a bike helmet just to walk because there is bikes everywhere it's amazing to see though like see even seeing like the older generation just cycling 11 o'clock at night doing a shot i loved it did you know tulips are originally from turkey the ottoman empire gifted them to holland what that is amazing Show us what you really brought. Natasha, if I show you that, I'll be chucked off. Was the chips delicious? So we went to the, like, what do you call it? The big place that's viral just now, I think. Everybody talks about it. I'm not going to lie. I wasn't overly impressed. They were okay, but I definitely prefer our chip shops. <laughs> I like it, Picasso. It's hanging on by a thread here. <laughs> you must be glad to be home. I would be if I lived in your house. It's blooming gorgeous. Thank you so much, Emir. We're definitely... Do you know what? It's always so nice to get away, but it's always so nice to get your own bed, isn't it? Like, there's no better feeling than climbing into your own bed. Well, if you don't already, follow us on Snapchat. I'm going to try putting the curlers in tonight. I will show you on Snapchat how I get on with them and if my hair's actually curly in the morning because it's got to be better. It kind of looks like a snail shell, doesn't it? I am the snail. Kimberly Ann, that is absolutely amazing. Exactly. Memories for life. Right, guys, I am off just now. Hope you all have a good afternoon, evening, and we will see you lots tomorrow. Lots of love to you all.